but it's really hard for me not to be able to help everyone. I hired Leah, my office manager, because she is a fantastic gatekeeper because I have no boundaries when it comes to patients. I want to love every single one of them. I would be there on Sunday afternoon, Sunday morning, midnight, anytime I would be there because I know it would make people better. And she's able to say, no, stop you know, you got to eat, <laughs> you need to pee, right? So she's so great at being able to structure that because that's been my biggest challenge being who I am is that I have a hard time saying no and limiting my schedule and limiting it so that I have, I get to see my husband and I get to come home occasionally, you know? And so that's been my biggest challenge. And we had actually talked to an optometrist a few months ago uh, who owns his own practice, and he, um, his own clinic, sorry, and he actually told us that that's one of the difficulties is dealing with things like insurance and the problem, problems with it. Um, what kind of challenges do you guys face at your clinic? So there's always challenges. Luckily, we don't have the insurance challenge because we are a cash practice, and we do create a ton of value for what we do. Um, every time I raise my prices, my patients go, about time, instead of getting mad at me for raising my prices, so we must be doing something right there. Um, I think the biggest challenge is for, for a very long time, for about four years now, we've had about a two- to three-month waiting list for new patients to get in, and that's very hard for me. It's very hard for me to know that I'm not able to help everyone I need to help, which is why I hired Dr. Ashley. And so now, she, now our wait list is getting shorter and shorter and shorter as she's, she's able to get people in sooner. But it's really hard for me not to be able to help everyone. I hired Leah, my office manager, because she is a fantastic gatekeeper because I have no boundaries when it comes to patients. I want to love every single one of them. I would be there on Sunday afternoon, Sunday morning, midnight, anytime. I would be there because I know it would make people better. And she's able to say, no, stop. You know, you got to eat. <laughs> you need to pee, right? So she's so great at being able to structure that because that's been my biggest challenge being who I am is that I have a hard time saying no and limiting my schedule and limiting it so that I have, I get to see my husband and I get to come home occasionally, you know? And so that's been my biggest challenge.